Hey Miranda, Joshua here with Peterson SEO, and thank you for uh, requesting a video today. Today I want to talk about lime green water damage and restoration technologies. But before we get into that, I want to explain and show you the three different ways on how your um, customers will find you. So um, with that, let's get started. Uh, water damage restoration Los Angeles. If we type this in. Um, we will come to the top here and you will get these sponsored Google guaranteed ads up here. Um, water damage fixes up here as a sponsored. So um, if you are sponsored, you will get up here. Uh, the second way to be found is it's called the map pack area with these three uh, businesses on the top positions of those. Um, 30% of your business will be found uh, here with these three top slots. Um, now, in order to get up here on these three slots, you need to uh, optimize your Google Business Profile at least 100%, and you need to come up with uh, uh, putting in your citations and everything. So, um, the third way on how pe people find you is uh, you have the, what's called the Organics, which is Yelp. Drymaster, which uh, is local, uh, your competitor, and Angie's List. Now, the reason why Yelp is up here real quick is because, because they're national and they are ranking in this area right now. Um, if we were to target locally, we could probably end up here. So, um, with that, those are the three uh, different ways on how you could be found and how your customers will find you in Google. Uh, don't forget, 70% come from this top three organic section. Okay, well, with that, let's get going. All right, so we're here to talk about lime green water damage restoration. I really like what you did with your logo. It looks really good. Um, I like how your number is clickable up here. Um, that button's really cool. Um, I really like how you have kind of this drop-down effect here. Like a drop box. Okay, let's kind of scroll down. You are IICRC certified. That's awesome. Okay, oh, I like these ones. These are really nice. I like how that pops. Okay, let's see. Okay, you got content here. Looks like you got a few keywords in here saved. Water damage. Okay. All right. Let's continue to go down. So, oh, and you got a form here. That's nice. It's a nice form. All right, so what Google really looks for and what Google likes and what they want is around 1,500 to 2,000 words of content in your front page alone. So it kind of looks like, let me take another quick peek. Okay, so it kind of looks like you have, I would say, 800 to 1,000 words of content on your home page. Now, what else Google likes is they love um, at least 250 keywords attached, or excuse me, at least uh, a key one keyword attached to every 250. So with that, with content, that's pretty much what Google looks for. And let's take a quick look at your competitor, drymaster.us. Uh, now let's take a quick look down. They don't have much content. They have these... Uh, um, keywords here that are saved in their content, and that could be why they are where they are. See mold remedi remedi mold remediation, remediation. Excuse me. See, see, they have uh, smoke damage, so they have some keywords, but they do not have content. So, and they're ranking up there, so it will be hard to beat these guys. So the next thing I wanted to show you was a little bit about backlinking and keywords, and we. The way we do that, we use a tool called Atrius. So I typed in lime green restoration.com and this will pull up a live, uh, basically a live uh, page on what your website is doing in the eyes of Google. So you have your strength here, your trust, and this is a 100 point scale with your 
You have 725 backlinks with 66 referrings going to it, domains. Um, you're using 25 organic keywords in your website, which is only bringing you one of organic traffic. Now with proper SEO backlinking, uh, we could change all that. So um, keep that in mind. Uh, it's very important that you have the right referring domains going to your backlinks as well. So you don't want just a bunch of backlinks piled up. Um, so you don't want, like, say, Pizza Hut linking to your website because nobody searches for that. So let's, uh, let's take a quick look at your organic keywords here. It looks like you got 29 um, attached to your website. Um, but out of all these, you're only getting one out of the deal. So um, definitely you could use some optimization. Let's kind of look and see at your competitor, okay? So they have 100 organic keywords. But they got 64 referrings, uh, 548 backlinks. Um, you have a little bit more. And they have, so it's around, you have more backlinks. They have less referring domains. So um, what also is important to note is these do follows here. These are the actual um, legit uh, set do follow sites that are going there. So um, you got about 22 there. So um, they are, they have a, uh, excuse me, they have a, a hundred organic keywords. And you have 25 that are getting you one traffic. They are getting 209 organic traffic here. So they're getting all the traffic, they're getting, excuse me, they're getting all the leads to all your customers. And just think of your your website as, you know, as a digital ATM machine, if you will. So you want to optimize them better. Um, these numbers here, you want to make sure they're as close as possible together. Um, whether you're down here or up here or, I mean, it's just what you want, really want to focus on is proper SEO backlinking. So um, in a nutshell, that's a... Uh, that's pretty much I have for, all I have for you, Miranda. Um, let's do a real quick recap of the ways you could be found. Sponsored, remember you're sponsored. Uh, you have your 30% of business that you'll land here if you're up here. It's citations. And also your three organics that are here. 70% um, of your business is found here. So with that, Miranda, um, I hope this information is useful to you. You could do with it as you will. It's yours, free to free, free to keep. Um, but if you need a guide to help you grow your business and, and help with proper SEO backlinking and proper optimization of your Google business profile, go ahead and give me a call. My name is Joshua at Peterson SEO Consulting.com. You can reach me at five zero five. 331-7995. Again, Joshua at Peterson SEO Consulting.com. And with that, I hope the rest of your day is good to you. And I hope to hear from you soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.